it won't cause that much of a lag for being live twice, and we'll just deal with it or uncue it if that's the case. Can I hear you? Can you hear me? I can hear you. That is good. We like hearing you. You're you're you, and that is a good thing. Yeah. Did you know that you are you? No. All right. Well, I'm with I'm with you, Katya. Now we're gonna. This is our first reaction to the penis monster. I mean, the DVD monster. <laughs> and it's gonna be like you know, like you know, like cool and shit and whatever and shit. just need to do uh, streaming there uh, can you go to my stream and tell me how's audio yeah, I will once the ad is done playing. I'm sorry about the ad. I know I I don't even make money. Um, audio seems fine so far, but I'm like, I'm personally kind of loud. You are loud? Yeah. Well, you're not loud to me, so... I'm gonna turn down like 10% and that's it. And I'm, then I'm... Okay. And turn the game up like 5%. And that is... And that is it. Um... Uh, yeah, I mean, the amount of fine so far. All right, yeah, so first things first is new HUD. They put it all on the left side. They said they did it just for spacing with letters and shit. Uh, neat stuff is uh, you can add bots to custom games, which is uh, fun for if you're just doing shit with your friends but you don't have enough people. Uh, you can also change your archive without being queued into a match. What so, now? Just, so just a quality of life thing. All right, Hattie Carr. Hattie is a brave and determined podcaster with the ability to see and feel places of great suffering. She calls overlaps. Says overlaps says. There should be a two. There should be an E and S there. Uh, her personal perks, inner focus, residual manifest, and overzealous allow her to track survivors and killers after an attack, use flashlights more effectively, and repair generators more efficiently. Oh my god, get this hair out of my face, oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, she has a little device with her, and she just dropped it, cool. <laughs> She's Reaper. She's Reaper. All right, Hattie Carr. Her three personal perks are inner focus. You have honed your ability to see through the haze of the ra of the ravage. What? Uh, you can see other survivors scratch marks within 32 meters of you. Oh, okay. Whenever was that a Nancy perk? Sorry. N Nancy had a perk called well, it's called self aware now. I forget what it was called, but um, she could see her own. Uh, but you can see other people's with this. Whenever another survivor loses a health state within 32 meters of you, the killer's aura is revealed to you for three seconds. That's that's decent, actually. That's, that kind of feels a bit like a training wheels perk, but uh, that's not a bad thing. Uh, flavor text, the death, the trauma, the fear, it all leads here, the overlap. 
Hattie Carr Ravages of the Abyss, episode 11. So she's a podcaster. They did not say this in the stream. Good God. Good God. Residual Manifest. A lifetime of chasing the darkness has taught you that the best disinfectant is light. That's a weird weird wording but okay after a successful killer blind action the killer is affected by the blind status for 20 seconds wait you can you can that was just a survivor status effect this perk grants the ability to rummage through an open chest once per trial and guarantee a basic flashlight that feels very useless but I feel like so many people are going to use it. I could see a lot of Fang Mings, Fang, Mi, Fang Mins using this. <laughs> uh, it's not. It doesn't sound super amazing, but still, the blindness stats effect that was just for survivors. That's weird. Not anymore. Not anymore. I'll never see what Hattie sees, but so long as I'm with her, I know I'm safe. Jordan Roy on episode five. Uh, overzealous. Fighting back against the Ravage motivates and inspires you. What is the Ravage? Uh, after cleansing any totem, this perk becomes active. Your generator repair speed is increased by 4%, and this perk deactivates when you lose a health state. Her perks so far seem fine. You seem okay. These two feel like training wheels perks, and this feels not game changer, but it's definitely making something. It's definitely making the use of flashlights a lot more useful, because I know that 20 seconds is going to go up when you level this perk up. Yeah, definitely. Let's queue up as her. Spend some blood points. I'm gonna turn down the game slight, slight bit. Okay. We already got a game. Awesome. Uh, I like to play a survivor game blind because it's funner that way to just not know what the killer's power is. Mm -hmm. Fair. Uh, let's let's use um 